everybody, my name is Jenna. Today I'm going to be doing my Christmas haul for 2019. I am so incredibly lucky to have received all of these gifts in the year of 2019. And I am also incredibly lucky that I have family and friends who know me so ridiculously well. It's not even funny how well they know me. Like I was opening these presents, I was like, are you people reading my mind? Either way, it was amazing. It was such a great day. I really enjoyed it and I loved, I love giving presents just as much just receiving them so it was really fun for me to see uh, everyone's faces when they open up the gifts that I got them it's something that I find really fun and really special and we're just gonna dive straight into the gifts that I got I'm going to do my best to remember who gave me everything I should do I didn't get a lot but what I did get was absolutely incredible and I'm so thankful for it I won't be keeping presents together though because that's just too difficult so I received this absolutely incredible gift from Kaylee she lives in Hobart now but um, she is one of my closest friends uh, she she is she knew from the channel she knew if you want to go and check her out which you should you should definitely check out her twitch account because she is hilarious and amazing and she bought me a Moana backpack I mean look at this it is the most gorgeous thing I have ever seen in my life it has Moana all over it. I have been using it every single day since I opened this up on Christmas Eve she rang me and we opened up our gifts together I've been using this every day this is now my new handbag I don't carry a handbag anymore I carry my little Moana backpack it's huge as well like it fits a drink bottle which is incredible and I love it and it's just so good and it makes me so happy oh every time I look at it I'm like that is gorgeous you know what we're just gonna lucky dive right in okay so next up we have from my grandparents I received moonlight perfume it's an Ariana Grande perfume it's amazing and beautiful and smells incredible like I haven't opened this one but I haven't opened one already it's funny I pulled it out and I was like yes more moonlight and my grandmother goes well have you already got that one and I was like oh yeah but it's fine like I'm almost empty. I'm not but I love the smell of this one so much that I'm actually really glad to have another box because it's amazing and once again people know me so well because like Ariana Grande she's I love everything about her she's amazing. From my aunt uh, her partner and my cousin I received a switch game Mario and Rabbids Battle Kingdom Battle. Um, I bought myself a Nintendo Switch Lite a couple of weeks before Christmas I think it was early December that I bought it and I ended up telling everyone that I would bought a Switch so I ended up getting a Switch game for Christmas which is awesome because I only had the one. I have been playing this game. It is so much fun. I love it to pieces and I'm really glad that I have it because like love Mario so much. Okay so my cousin just started working um, this past year and she decided to buy us all Christmas presents which was adorable and I love her to pieces. She bought me this incredible little Harry Potter ceramic mug. I'm gonna open it because I haven't actually opened it yet um, to see the other side of it but it is so cute. Cute. She said to me when I opened it, she's like, I know you don't drink hot drinks at all, but I thought you could still use it like on your bookshelf or something. Cause I actually have a mug up here, a Disney mug, which holds all my bookmarks. I was like, yes. Oh my goodness. Of course. <gasps> Look at this. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Look at it. Oh my God. So we've got like Harry, Hermione, Snape, Minerva, Ron, Sirius, Albus Dumbledore. There's a Dobby there, a Hagrid. Look at Hedwig and Neville. Oh my goodness. Fred and George and Malfoy and Bellatrix and Ginny and Voldemort. Ah! Um, this is the cutest mug ever. I am actually in love with it. I don't know where I'm going to put it yet or what I'm going to put in it, but I'm definitely going to put something in it because it's so cute. Oh. oh my goodness. I love how they've put Hagrid like right next to Hedwig. <laughs> So cute. Also from my aunt and my cousin and my aunt's partner, I received these metal straws. If I can get them out. I struggle a little bit with metal straws. Um, I struggle to use them just because I think they, it's not that they taste well, they kind of taste weird, but they kind of hurt my teeth. But I do want to be more environmentally uh, sound. So I am definitely gonna make sure that I have these with me at all times. So I've got one like straight one and one curvy one. Yeah, they just, they're weird but I think you can get like little rubber stops for them or something so I might look at getting some of those so that I can use them without killing my teeth and you've got these as well which are like the cleaners which I think is really really cool so these were an awesome gift and something I wasn't expecting because these are so environmentally uh, sound and I love that oh and then I got lots of money and gift cards which is amazing because I need new clothes <laughs> so I'm definitely gonna be taking that money to go buy new clothes and then from Emily who knows me stupidly well 
well, she got me this tote bag, which is just the Harry Potter letter, well, the Mr. H Potter, the cupboard under the stairs, privet drive. So I have this tote bag, which is really awesome. I do love tote bags. I've um, started getting into the habit now of taking tote bags with me when I go to the shops. So when I go like clothing shopping or just pretty much, I, I brought tote bags with me when I went Christmas shopping. So I didn't get a single plastic bag. I only used tote bags. And that's something that I'm really trying to stick with so that I use less plastic and just use all of the amazing tote bags that I've been given over the years. And then we got this bag. This bag's real heavy. Okay. I did not get this tote bag for Christmas, but you know. So I have this card from Kaylee and it's the cutest thing. It's got like a little Wookiee pin, which I love. So definitely gonna have to put that up somewhere. She wrote me a bit of an essay, but like Kaylee, I'm calling you out. Your handwriting is awful. I'm really glad she was on the phone with me at the time. So I was like, Kaylee, I can't read this. I'm gonna need you to read it for me. Was that bad? Oh, I left a present in the lounge room. So I'll have to go get that. From my parents, I got another Switch game and that was Ice Age Scratch Nutty Adventure. I am obsessed with Ice Age and I love Scratch. I started playing this one as well and it's really a lot of fun. You literally just just like run around picking up crystals and looking for temple stuff. Lots of fun, you get to play as Scrat and he does his weird little jump and he's just... Oh. The game cartridge was not in there, everything's fine. Then I have lots of packaging. I have this. Ah, a Christmas card from my aunt, her partner, and my cousin. I think she, my cousin did it, which was cute. For my book club this year, we always do a dinner. And this year, the girls, Mari and Amelia, they are the ones who run the wire circle. They are incredibly, incredible people, and I love them, and I love what they do. So this year, they decided to do a book swap, which is we get paired up with someone. You can either purchase them a new book, or you can give them a book off of your shelf. But basically, you just have to give them something you think that they will love. And I received this book from, I don't even know who my book swap person was so I can't even thank them but I received Daughter of Smoke and Moan by Lainey Taylor. I've never read this one and I don't know much about it at all but I'm really really excited to read it now because I know everyone seems to love it. Everyone loves Lainey Taylor's prose as well so I think it's something that I'm really going to enjoy. From my parents I received Ariana Grande's Thank You Next perfume. Like I said people know me because Ariana Grande is amazing and I love her and I immediately had to like get it out of the box. I got the little one. My sister got the big one. I got the little one and it's the cutest thing. It has the nicest smell as well. We smelt it when we were buying my mum uh, perfume actually and it's got a really mature smell as well so you can tell that she's definitely grown up a lot um, just by that like, when you compare all the different scents she's got and it's amazing and I now have every single one that she has except I think for Frankie but I don't think that's one that I would like. So good. Can't wait to start using that one because I love Ariana and I love her perfumes. They're so good. Actually wearing one right now. Wearing Ari at the moment so that's good. Okay next step. Oh this is just more stuff that I got at the Wire Circle dinner. I got this little chapter sampler for Havenfall and I got a City of Girls notebook, which is gonna be a lot of fun because I had a bookmark that had a number on it. So I got to pick a notebook, which is great. Um, it's also got blank paper in it as well, which is really interesting. Like I thought it would have lined paper. It doesn't, it's just blank. So I don't know what I'm gonna use that one for yet, but I'm excited. So for Secret Santa at work, I have not been working there for very long. I started working there probably in August, but I didn't start properly working there until late September. So when it came to doing Secret Santa, I put my hand up and was like, yes, I'd love to participate. And turns out uh, my nerdiness has shone through in the few months that I've been there because this is what my Secret Santa bought me. She bought me a Yoda Santa pop vinyl. I, when I opened it, I lost it. I was like, oh my God, this is incredible. It's so cute. He has like a little Santa sack and his little walking stick. And I just, I love everything about this. And I love that my coworkers already know me so well. I guess that sort of says a lot about me, but like, it's fine. Next up, we have another present from Emily. Like I said, the girl knows me. So she bought me a Frozen 2 notebook and a Frozen 2 sticker set. If anyone has been watching my channel for a while, you'll know that I've seen, well, you might not know, but I've seen Frozen 2 three times now. I listen to the soundtrack all the time because I love it so much and it's so good. And I can't wait to um, use my Frozen notebook and put my Frozen stickers everywhere because I'm legit five years old. <laughs> Emily also bought me a t-shirt, a Harry Potter t-shirt. And it's got a fluffy headwig on it. So it says, waiting for my letter from Hogwarts. And then, I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, but look, it's fluffy. I have zero idea how you're meant to wash something that's fluffy. So I haven't worn this one yet because, like, I'm a little nervous. I hope it tells you. Cold, gentle machine wash inside out in laundry bag. Solid. But yeah, it's so cute and I love it so much. And I'm really excited to start wearing it because look at Edwig. Oh my God. So cute. And then I actually got a second t-shirt this year. Um, I knew I was getting this one though because my sister and I were at Supernova together when she bought it. And that is a Shadowhunters shirt. So it says Shadowhunters Academy. Uh, 
said Lex Dura Lex. I have no idea. Established in 1234 and it's got the angel rune on it. And I just oh, love it. I'm so excited to uh, start wearing this one because I love Shadow Hunters and I want to be able to share that with the world. Next up, I have a calendar that my uh, parents bought me. And once again, they know me so well. It's a Disney calendar. I opened it and I was like, oh my goodness and it's got all this cool stuff on it. So it's got like old school um, posters for Alice in Wonderland, Dumbo, Lady in the Tramp, Peter Pan, Sleeping Beauty, Jungle Book, and 101 Dalmatians. Oh, Cinderella and Bear Me and Pinocchio, but I know I've got two Alice and Sleeping Beauty ones, and I love it. My mum also forgot to take the price tag off, so you know, she's doing so well, <laughs> but I don't care. Um, and that was because she was putting in, she needed something to put out tickets in for, so I got a ticket for West Side Story, which I have actually already seen, and and then I got a ticket for School of Rock as well. So West Side Story was in November this year, so it was an early Christmas present. And then we got School of Rock, which is for next April, which I'm really, really, really excited to see. And then my sister and her partner, as well as getting me the Shadowhunters TV, um, Shadowhunters TV, the Shadowhunters shirt, they also bought me the illustrated edition of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. I have been lacking with the illustrated editions. I only have the first two. So now I have Prisoner of Azkaban and it's absolutely gorgeous. Like it's purple under the dust jacket and I've had a look through at some of the images and truly it's just absolutely gorgeous. I'm uh, silently, secretly hoping that I get Goblet of Fire for my birthday which is coming up at the end of January. She doesn't watch these videos so I can't even give her a hint but this is just so good and I'm so happy that I finally have it because it's so gorgeous. And then the last present I have to talk about is one I nearly forgot about because it was on the Christmas tree and that is this adorable little Hufflepuff ornament that Emily bought me. It's the cutest thing ever because she when we exchanged presents she was like okay we have to open this one now because it's got something in there that you need to use now and I said to her not doing it I'm opening up the presents on Christmas day and she was like fine give it here I'll extract this from it so she extracted this very carefully from her wrapped present and then rewrapped it while we were sitting at the dinner table for the wire circle dinner quite amusing but this is the cutest thing I don't even think I'm gonna pack this away when I pack away the Christmas tree I'm gonna put it up in my room somewhere because it's too cute not to show and there you have it that was everything Everything that I received for Christmas this year, like I said, I am so incredibly blessed and grateful to have received all of these gifts. I just am so excited that I wanted to share them with you guys. And yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below what you got for Christmas because I would absolutely love to know. If you like this video, be sure to give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a thing. Stay random. Bye.